everybody lazy man 06 here I'm going to start doing motorcycle related product reviews versus the videos I I had under my old name same channel new name but the first thing I want to start with is the outlaw vintage motorcycle riding mask I got this for twenty dollars off of leatherup.com and overall I am really enjoying this product the plastic isn't overly thick but that keeps it very bendy I guess would be the word you know for different size heads so it can expand out whatever and and what they've done is basically taken like a pair of motocross goggles and this bottom part or actually removed just by pulling down on this and up on the goggles. I'm not going to take it apart because it is a pain in the rear to get back on. I will say when I first put it on, I did notice a chemically chemical smell, probably from the glue that glues the uh, the cushion on the goggles, you know, to the actual plastic itself. It has two air holes one here one here has a small foam filter in the middle and the only issue I really have with it is I wear glasses and they don't really fit inside real well without you know, having to force it and I mean I can adjust it to where it is comfortable but just initially putting it on it's not you know it's it's kind of a pain more ways than one uh, has a tinted visor or lens I guess it is from what I can tell it is not like you know shatter resistant it's just as flexible as the rest of it but for someone who really can't wear sunglasses that easily it is a huge help uh, I'm going to keep also, my reviews, I'm going, to start, I'm going to kind of keep them short and sweet. Because, I mean, there's really not much to say. I mean, for $20, and if you want something, you know, pretty cool looking, uh, this, this is actually not bad at all. I mean, cheaper than a, uh, what is it, the Bell Rogue, which is the helmet, the mask and everything, is like 200 and something dollars. You know, just for something cool looking when I've got the mask and just a regular Daytona half helmet and uh, I'll put the uh, I have a picture of what they look like together as the cover photo for the video but yeah leatherup.com $20 and if you haven't if you haven't bought anything from leatherup.com before this thing got here and like i remember about a day or so after you know after order to see if they had updated my shipping and i hadn't seen anything so i figured they were going to tell me they were out or you know they're just having an off day but lo and behold like the next day it was on my front doorstep so they have incredible prices, incredible shipping, and I mean anything I I really buy I go through Leather Up, unless I can you know if they have it local then I might pick it up local just so I don't have to wait. But anyway, yeah if you're interested in this the Outlaw Vintage Motorcycle Mask, actually let me get the box here kind of show you what looks like with the helmet on the box they use it with a three-quarter type which I don't have one of those but I might actually get one for this helmet pick some of those up pretty cheap very very Chinese English stuff going on here I y'all read that high quality sponge soft elastic toughness High elasticity with carbon material and good toughness. Yeah, uh, not the not the best. 
and there's how it detaches. I was really hoping when it came in that the mask part was the one that had the, the strap on it, but I got to thinking and it would almost have to be the goggles. But regardless, I, I really like it. Anyway, uh, there's my review and if you like the video and you want to see more, please comment below and hit that subscribe button and I will try and keep, keep these updated. Thank you and have a great night.